the stats every minute this week. I'm doing my part, I'm paying attention, and I play my position. In this video, we're going to talk about a meme coin uh, pre sell that uh, I'm particularly bullish on. I think that this one can do really well for the simple fact that it is a little bit different to what we've seen in the market. It has an edge, in my opinion, um, and that is thinkdifferent.io or think different. Okay, and this is based on the whole Apple Steve Jobs type of theme. Um, this is launching on Solana. Um, so, and this is a pre sell I'll show you how you can get into this particular project. They've currently raised 939 Solana at the time of recording this video. And um, some of the reasons why I'm bullish on this particular project is being called out by some very large influencers, but not your usual suspects, which you see on Twitter and, and YouTube. Okay, guys, there is still seven days left in the pre-sale, so there probably will be a few more people talking about it. But uh, this guy has 311k uh, subscribers on YouTube. He's extremely bullish on this project. Also, Silinex uh, Crypto or Silinex Crypto is somebody who I watch sometimes on TA. This guy normally only just talks about charts, right? And he's actually talking about this pre-sale and. Um, this is what he said about this pre-sale, which made me bullish because, you know, ultimately, there's a lot of scams out there. You don't know where you're putting your money, right? Sometimes, right? But Cillian Crypto says that he knows the team. So let's just play this little clip. Okay, so as you can see, Silinix Crypto, he has 55,000 followers as well. And he claims that he knows the team. He's worked with them before and they've had previous successful projects. So they've got a good success rate. And that made me a little bit more confident to get into this project. Okay, because ultimately, I actually heard of this project from one of my Patreon members. Um, I was going to post about this particular pre-sale, which you cannot buy anymore. This ended... Uh, the pre-sale for this ended yesterday and this launch is tomorrow. It's called Quack on Base Chain. All right, guys. But I actually liked uh, Fink when he brought it to my attention. I thought I would add it to the list, the pre-sale list on this particular uh, post for the patrons. Okay, guys. So if you want, if it, the link is in the description for Patreon if you want to get in on some of these early calls. Okay, guys. But this one I'm putting out to everybody. Okay, because ultimately... Um, he's got quite a while left and you know sometimes I come across projects and I don't have time to get the video out so this one I have time to get the video out uh, there's nothing else really to talk about at the moment as well so why not talk about this um, although it does have seven days left uh, there's plenty of time for you to do your own research okay guys so again they've raised 939 Solana which you can verify on uh, Soul Scan as well or soul scan, however you pronounce it. Um, guys, if you're thinking, like, how is the best way to get money over to Solana? Uh, or the quickest way, the fastest way, right? Uh, I don't tend to use a lot of bridges, right? But I use Change now, and um, it's pretty easy to use, okay, guys? You literally just, if you want to send from, for example, from Ethereum to Solana, you just choose uh, ETH at the top of Solana, okay, guys? You put exactly how much you want to you wanna send, Right, and then you put your Solana payout address in this box here. Press confirm. Okay, guys, let's just uh, give you an example. Right, uh, uh, let's just let's just use that. That's not a Solana address, okay? But in fact, let's just go ETH to ETH. Okay, so I send a lot of ETH over to Base Chain as well. So you look for ETH Base over here. ETH Base, for example, sake, right? Uh, press confirm and it will basically give you an address uh, to send your ethereum to so you just copy that address right and then you go in your metamask you send you don't have to connect your wallet or anything you can but uh, you can just go in your metamask send one ethereum to this address and then that will basically uh, you know send your ethereum to the address the designated address designated chain and so on okay guys so for solana you're just going to type in solana 
and you'll you'll put in your Solana address right here. You press confirm, it will give you an address to send your Ethereum to or your BNB or whatever it is that you're sending. And you can do that vice versa from vice versa from Solana to Ethereum to a linear network or whatever. Okay, guys. Um, so that's a quick way to get your money to and from different chains um, for a very small fee. Okay, instead of paying some huge bridge fee and things like that. Or, or you know going through a centralized exchange which a lot of people don't want to do because of kyc and things like that you can use uh uh change now but what i wouldn't do is i wouldn't go into the pre-sale using this because you need to send it directly from your address so you can receive tokens directly back to your address because there's two ways to get into this particular pre-sale right uh, so you can do it directly from the website and uh, you know if you've got concern about connecting your wallet and things like that you don't have to do that you can literally just go and send ethereum uh, sorry not ethereum solana uh, from your solana wallet directly to the solana address that they have okay the pre-sale address uh, which starts with think as well um so this is a pretty uh, organized team the link to tweet is on if you go to their Twitter, right, it will be right there on Twitter. If you go to the website, if you don't want to collect your wallet, okay, because you will need a phantom wallet, by the way. If you don't want to connect your wallet, right, uh, just literally come over and click on hit Twitter up there. It will take you over to Twitter and it will basically provide you with the uh, the pre-sale address for you to send Solana to. The minimum will be 0.1 Solana. And some of the tokenomics have released here is 45% to pre-sale and 45% to LP. Uh, sorry, 45% pre-sale plus 45% LP will go to will will go into the, the the project and then 10% to airdrop. Okay, guys, because people are putting their address and getting airdrops, they're sending tokens uh, to people as well. Um, you know, it probably won't be a significant amount of tokens in airdrop. Uh, so that's why I think it's a good idea to, it's not financial advice, but to buy some of this particular project. Now, is it memeable? I think it is memeable with the whole um, Apple, Steve Jobs type theme. Um, it's black and white as well, which I like because it, it sets it apart. It's different, right? The, the whole project is called Think Different. In order to stand out, you need to be a little bit different. So, so their whole theme is black and white. The website's black and white. It does lack color. But that's what basically gives it, you know, an edge. It sets it apart. It stands out. And uh, people will look at it and think, yo, what is this? Why are all the memes black and white? What is this? Okay, guys. And, of course, it's a dog. So, you know, with the dog meta, uh, you know, meme coins, meme dogs is always done well. Um, so, I really like this one uh, for the simple fact that it's got all of those different things about it. It's called Think Different. And, ultimately... You know, when it comes to meme coins, you need to find something that's unique, something that's original. I think this one's unique. It's original and, you know, it could potentially do well. Again, it's got some pretty large people talking about it. Okay, guys. So, you know, when it comes to KOLs, uh, KOLs calling it on Twitter as well later um, after it launches and things like that, I think we see a lot of that. A lot of people won't tell you about a project in the pre-sale. Uh, which is probably, you know, that could be a reason why you don't see a lot more people talking about it right now. They're, they're more likely to get into the pre-sale than, you know, when when it launches and, and they're up a few X's already, they will then shill it to you. It will pump a little bit more and then it usually is exit liquidity. That tends to be the strategy a lot of the time with a lot of, you know, influencers on Twitter and those kind of things, right? So... You know, it's very rare you're going to get people telling you about this stuff in the pre-sale phase, right? But, um, you know, it's like Slurf, for example. Slurf is one that went absolutely crazy, right? And, you know, I never heard of any Slurf pre-sale. Um, you know, uh, the guy ended up burning uh, $11 million by accident and then the Slurf launch and that went crazy. But I've heard of a lot of these uh, pre-sales uh that people have got into or they've raised millions and millions of dollars. It's like, yo, how did I not hear of this in the pre-sale? Why am I getting, only getting an opportunity to buy it now? Now it's at 20, 50 million market cap, right? Um, so you do get that a lot. Okay, but this one, I think that this could be a good opportunity 
It doesn't guarantee anything, but it does look good. And as Silinix uh, Crypto said in his video, he knows the team has worked with them before. They've had previous successful projects. I'm assuming that those projects have ran into the millions or multiples of millions in order to be successful. Could even be the hundreds of millions or billions. I don't know. I don't know the team myself. Okay, guys, but, you know, ultimately, is this an opportunity? There's a potential uh, There's a potential there, and I'm sharing it with you now. Okay, guys, so, you know, let me know what you think in the comments. That's really all I've got for you in this video. Um, again, uh, it has seven days before the pre-sale ends, and then I'm sure it will probably go live after that. We'll probably see a bunch of marketing or post-launch marketing as well. 939 uh, soul raised at the minute. I believe that's probably about 130 to $135,000 approximately, possibly, or probably more, maybe 939, almost 1,000 soul. Let's see what the price of Solana is at the moment. Um, $178. Let's go, was, 900 and, was it 934 soul? uh 166,934 939 so okay so 939.4 let's put the point four hundred and sixty seven thousand six hundred and sixty dollars that's what they've raised in just a couple of days um so this will be a lot higher in the next seven days um especially if more people talk about it and um you know the more that they raise the thicker the lp will be the more money there'll be for marketing and things like that so we'll see how it goes guys that's really all i've got for you in this video like comment subscribe hit the little bell for notifications i'll see you in the next one